We certainly have perceived that there is an element of, you know, um, of interest in Gibraltar and it seems to be a positive thing, right? Um, I think that obviously the fact that Gibraltar voted uh, by a margin of 96% to remain with the EU, that's something that has resonated here in the EU. Um, but saying that though, I think there's still obviously you know, wide misconceptions about what Gibraltar is about. So, for example, you might have those in individuals who are very interested and know about the issue and, you know, they think about, well, you know, Gibraltar is an issue, we need to really solve this. But then there are those who might not be somewhat, or might be somewhat oblivious to what Gibraltar is about and then it's difficult for us to actually put across, we have to put across literally what the reality of the situation is and sort of like, you know, say this is what happens on the Spanish side, this is our, our relationship with the Spanish side and the Spanish side with the Gibraltar and effectively something which is beneficial for both communities. So, I mean, suddenly, you know, we think that these are friends in the making, no? Uh, I think it's something, obviously, that part of the group's strategy, which is to continue lobbying and making sure that individuals all throughout Europe are fully aware of what, you know, Gibraltar and the surrounding Campo de Gibraltar are, are all about.